how to thread the machine okay so I'm not going to do a many crazy thing it's just a very simple uh, video to teach people how to do it for that I will recommend any person who can read the manual if you can read it I think it's page 25 or 20 something yeah I think it start on the 20 22 and further you can see how to thread the machines and all the good stuff I will recommend any person to do it and read it so that way you understand better your machine I'm not going to put the foot because it's just only for thread the machine the machine is, is very simple and then since the machine have numbers so you just follow the numbers so one of the first part that we need to do with the machine is um, threading the machine directly to um, this area, which is gonna be the thread. So this is a thread that normally I use for everything that I, I do for school. So normally you have to come like this way. So you have to come from this area first. So we're gonna put here the thread all the way and then it came this kind of stuff, which is kind of holder. You just put in there, and that will hold the thread and pull money to show up. <laughs> well, basically, that's the first step. Now, the machine have numbers. So normally, this area here is directly for um, filling the bobbin, which we already did already. And this diagram here is for filling the bobbin. So you are not going to worry about this area. You're going to be worried about this area further. So the first thing is pass the thread over here. So we're going to do that. Then you do have this area here that you need to pass the thread up in here. As you can see here, it's showing you how to do it. Then we're going to do, we're gonna pass the thread all the way through here, which is step number two. Then we're going to pass all the way through here, which is number three. Then we're going up. And then we do have this thing here. You're going to pass the thread up in here. Then again, going down, pass the thread up in here, which is five. But the situation is this with number five. You have to pass the thread going back here, then it's going to be here. Then you can put it on the needle, which is here. So that is the whole diagram. So we're gonna try to do it step by step. Now, so the thread is here. So we're going to pass the thread for the first and the second. So we're gonna take the thread this way as you guys can see, we're gonna pass through here, this way, and then we're going to pass through here, this way. And that's it. One and two, done. Okay, after one and two is done, so we now we're going to do number three. Number three is basically pass this thread around the bottom that's it that's number three number four as you can see this is the metal here what we need to do is pass the thread through the loophole is there so we go in there and done after that is done we're going to do number five which is a little bit more complicated so after we do number four now we're going to do number five. Number five is like, I see as two step in ones, okay? So basically we're gonna take this thread, pulling down, pass this portion here, make sure it's past this area, like this, and then we're gonna pass through here, through this small thing, pass here. I always use my other finger to hold it here pass here and that's it so I'm gonna try to show you how to thread the machine 
Um, this turning machine, at least for me, has been not being super helpful. But um, let's see if you guys try something different. But I tried to use it, but it's not really super helpful to me. Like for 10 times, seven will use, I mean, seven will be working in the other knot. But I don't care so much about it. Um, I really like the machine, so let's try. So the way we're going to do it is, we, this is a threaded machine system. So you're gonna pull this down. You're gonna take the thread, which is this one, right? Put it through this hook, as you can see. This one here, this is the hook. You're gonna pull, put in here like this, and then pass this so the machine is engaged. And you're gonna take the thread and push it all the way to the back of the machine like this, and then release. And that thread the machine, as you can see here, is thread. Put it in this way so you can guys can see. So that thread the machine. So the machine is ready to sewing now.